In 1986, Ronald Reagan said, to preserve our land, we must look to God. And it's time that we as a people realize that we need God more than he needs us. And I hope, Quanell, that this 4th of July and on Independence Day, we as a people will, will express our gratitude to God for all that he's done to give us liberty and freedom. You know, for you to say that is very ironic because I believe that God is very ashamed of America in regards to the happy 4th of July holiday. We call it in my circles, happy 4th of July holiday because black men died fighting for America's independence from Europe, died by the thousands to help America win her independence. And she promised us our freedom if we did that. And after we helped America win independence, we were still slaves. So the great lie of Happy Fourth of July is that black people never got their freedom after helping America fight for hers. The Democrat Party, Quanell, has done more to enslave the Democrat uh, black people in America than you can possibly imagine. The War on Poverty by Lyndon Baines Johnson, his, his Great Society movement, was nothing more than a war on the black family. Yeah, but you like to run away from the subject matter. I'm gonna keep your foot to the fire. The 4th of July is an outright lie in this country because everybody didn't win their freedom. So if black people want to wave an American flag and happy 4th of July, remember our ancestors was kept in slavery after we helped America win our independence. But so because this of the holiday Party, should be called for what it is. And to us, it ain't Democrats or Republicans. It's all of the political powers in this country, both white on both houses that mistreated black people during that quote unquote 4th of July era when America was winning her independence from Europe and we fought and bled and died for it and we got no independence. So this Democratic Party stuff, Lyndon Baines Johnson, that ain't got a damn thing to do with the 4th of July lying to black people and not giving us our freedom when we helped to win hers. This is the freest country in the world and black people have been given more opportunity in America than any country in the world, Quanell. You can say anything you want. This is a great nation, I will admit to that. America is great, but great don't make you good. The way we become good is honoring God. <laughs>